Pfizer is now looking to see COVID vaccine authorization for a new age group. KSBY News reporter Gina Avalos spoke to some local parents and has more details on who would fall into the new age group if approved. As of right now, children's ages 12 and up can get the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine. But soon enough, if authorized, that could expand to younger children ages 5 through 11. According to Pfizer, data shows the vaccine is safe and effective for the younger population. I'm optimistic about it. I think that uh, as long as the science is clear and, and, um, and people, the appropriate authorities have taken a look at it, I, I like the idea. Others are not too convinced and say they'd prefer to wait. I'm fortunate in that my son's only three, uh, so it gives me time to think about when he is five. But if he was five now, I would still be in the same predicament. I'd want to wait. In a statement, Pfizer chairman said in part, over the past nine months, hundreds of millions of people ages 12 and older from around the world have received our COVID-19 vaccine. We are eager to extend the protection offered by the vaccine to this younger population subject to regulatory authorization. Well-known local pediatrician Dr. Rene Bravo says he believes it's a good move. Prior to this, the only protection that we've had for children is getting the adults vaccinated. And there are some children, especially in the 5 to 11 age group, who are at risk for complications. We have immunocompromised situations or of diseases that would predispose them to adverse outcomes. Bravo adds he, along with other pediatricians across the state, have seen an increase in COVID-19 cases among children. He says although the risk of severe illness or death is lower in children compared to adults, getting them vaccinated is the right move. But we're still waiting for the next review of the data and the process to work before this is finally released. Um, but in the meantime, people should just continue the precautions that we're using and just be patient out there. Just be patient out there. We're going to get through this. In Santa Maria, Gina Avalos, KSBY News. Pfizer says it aims to apply for the FDA's emergency use authorization in this new age group by the end of the month.